been your favorite Brian moment? Um. What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba and Marina and one of the things that I've always done as, as an instructor is always try to have good quality management or quality control of myself as an instructor. And what I mean by that is, is after every class I teach, it doesn't matter if it's open water or rescue or a specialty or even an instructor level course, is I'll sit down with a student and say, hey, what did you really think about this course? What did you really think about me as the instructor? Is there anything that I could have done to make it better as far as more educational or more entertaining? so it's not quite as boring as what most classes are and the, like I said I want to better myself as an instructor and by doing this questionnaire with my students it's always made me grow even better as an instructor. Well, I want to do the same thing tonight with my employees because not only do I want to be a better instructor, I want to be a better employer as well. And tonight we're having our annual Christmas party. And so for the ones that are uh, willing to come in and actually tell me what they really think about me, I'm going to give them free reign to say anything and everything they want about me because I truly want to be a better employer to them. And one of the things that I really believe is, is if I take good care of my employees, they will take good care of our customers. In return, those customers will take good care of the company, and then, of course, the company will take good care of me as well. So let's sit down with each one and see what they really think about working for Brian Stafford here at Lake Hickory Scuba. Hey, guys. My name's Jason Moretz, and I'm an open water instructor at Lake Hickory Scuba. Hey, my name's Buddy. I'm a dive master here at the dive shop. My name is Brianna and I'm a mermaiding and freediving instructor. Brian Owen, me, open water instructor with Lake Hickory Scuba. My name is Jason, I'm a dive master for Lake Hickory Scuba and Marina. Hi, I am Michael Moritz, I am Jason Moritz's son and I am a master diver here. I'm Carson and I'm a scuba ranger and a mermaid. I'm Tessa and I'm a scuba ranger and mermaid. He talks entirely too much. When he texts me and expects a response, even if I don't have service. I hate hearing all the stories about how good of a diver he was when he was still in his diapers. Well, the most thing, like, I hate that he always messes up my hair. <laughs> well, what I really hate about working for Brian is every time we go somewhere, he's got to turn sideways to get his big inflated head through the door. <laughs> <laughs> Every time he helps me film a video, I think he does it fine, and then he has me read what 777,000 times before he finally gets it, and then he has somebody else redo it. So one of the things about Brian is, you know, in the summer, he's in the water almost every single day, um, scuba diving, looking for lost things, doing salvage work. However, sometimes Brian thinks that being in the water scuba diving is a form of taking a shower. Um, and it's not, man, really. Take a shower every day with soap. He's okay. So yes, Brian is an excellent scuba diver. He is really everything he, he says he is and more. Just listen to him. However, one thing I will say, Brian does not know as much about human anatomy and physiology as I do as an emergency department nurse. I guess so. I mean, it doesn't seem that bad. I'll put it this way. I like to buy Brian for what he's worth and sell him for what he thinks he's worth. I'd say so. So far he hasn't had a colony bus dive probe to come get him yet. That one I'd say yeah he is. 
Well, I haven't dove that much with him, but I could probably say from the previous, I guess uh, he's okay. He's good. Well, this is time a couple years ago. Me and Brian decided we was going to do branch out in our diving experience. And we really wanted to dive hard hat helmets. Dive hard hats. So I was fine. A Kirby Morgan super light fits me great. The engineers at Kirby Morgan are still trying to figure out how to make the helmet big enough. <laughs> um. He, he always has good jokes and they always make me laugh, so. He's a really good joker when he takes me deer hunting. So my favorite Brian moment actually has nothing to do with scuba diving. I was here at the shop hanging out one day and um, Brian's also a first responder for the local fire department and had a medical call. Um, being an ER nurse, he asked me if I wanted to ride with him. I was like, yeah, sure, I'll go with you. So we get in the truck, he turns on all his Ricky Rescue lights, they're blinking and just, you know, going nuts, and off we go down the road. And I am so glad that Brian is a magnificent scuba diver because he cannot drive for crap. Oh, probably my favorite Brian moment. Going out to go check out a brand new truck that we were uh, going for recovery, and guess what? We all got suited up and someone forgot his mask. When he was nice to me, because it only happened once. <laughs> Um, probably when me, my dad, and Brian were filming my dad's video for his conference, that, and the things that happened during that, that was funny. Well, Brian, to be a professional diver, he got on my boat, we went to a dive site, we got geared up, ready to dive in, and he forgot his mask. So next time I can mess his hair up. Same. The way he looks in a mermaid tail. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a long story. But if I could change, I actually changed this about Brian, so I'm happy to tell this one. One day I was bored, and all my friends was busy, so I needed to talk to someone just to waste time. So I decided I'd call Brian. So I called Brian and I got his voicemail and I heard, Hi, this is Brian from Lake Hickory Scuba, co-owner, course director, blah, 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 blah. I'm Gray Brian. <laughs> it's basically what I heard for like 15 minutes. So after that conversation, listening to his voicemail, I hung up. <laughs> Does it have to be only one? I want to change a lot of things. If I could change one thing about Brian, you don't need to wear sunglasses inside, man. The way he spells his name. So if I could change one thing about Brian, I'd probably make him more like his dad, Tim. Oh! <laughs> burn! Yes. So there you go, guys. That's what my employees really think about me. Um, the purpose of this video was to become a better employer. And just like I do questionnaires with my students, I wanted to do a questionnaire with my employees to see what they really felt about me so that I know what I need to do to change to make a better work environment for them. Because like I said, I truly believe that if I take good care of my employees, they're going to take good care of my customers. In return, my customers will take good care of the company and myself as well. But I want to say a huge Merry Christmas to all my staff. Thank you for everything that you do here at Lake Hickory Scuba. Uh, we truly appreciate each and every one of you, and you guys work extremely hard to make our company grow, and it is definitely shown. But guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, simply smash that like button for me. Definitely share it as well. As always, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, like us on Facebook, pin us on Pinterest, subscribe to us here on YouTube, and as always, guys, we appreciate your business. Oh, and Jason, I'm going to take your advice. No more glasses in the building. All right, question three. Is Brian really as good of a diver as he claims to be? So yes, Brian is a great diver. However, Brian likes to tell fish stories. 
like he thinks that is like this, but it's really about like this. <laughs> we change with him in the locker room. <laughs> Now, he's teaching your children how to learn how to dive, and he's talking about, yeah. Question one, name, title, and position. So my name is Brian. I am the co-owner of Lake Hicker Scuba, and I'm an instructor trainer. Ooh. <laughs>